Hey, welcome to another new creature review. This is Omar. How you doing? Today we are checking out Star Wars The Black Series, Vice Admiral Holdo. Now, if you saw my un, uh, my unboxing video, this is, uh, this is one of my uh, most anticipated Black Series figures. And the uh, truth be told, the only reason why is because it's Laura Dern. Um, let's go ahead and look at this right now. Look at that likeness. The eyes are a little bit light but wow i have a figure that looks like laura dern with purple hair purple laura dern that's what i've been calling her vice admiral holdo but let's let's look at the details here look at this hair you guys know i am a sucker for gorgeous hair and this is incredible look at all those loops and curls and they just like they overlap each other and it looks like they're like purposely knotted up on like around her head we got this uh little tiara thing going looks kind of like a horseshoe but the wash is nice and the uh the mold is nice on this hair look at that face it's so gorgeous it looks really nice i can't i'm i'm gushing <laughs> this is such a nice figure um i do not like this if i had the option i would take this off if there was like a plastic version of this underneath but there isn't so yeah it kind of looks potato sacky but if you if you've seen the movie that she is in um the last jedi you know her shoulders are slightly showing like this but um yeah a f um a follower on Instagram saw, uh, saw this and said, hey, try this. And it does look okay, but because I have a, a seam kind of coming loose right here, it still kind of looks like a potato sack. You know, but that kind of, it feels nice. It's like a like a soft, velvety, like burlap kind of. <laughs> it's not, I mean, but it kind of, it looks nice. Um, and we have all these uh, wrinkles coming up on up her sleeve right here all the little details are so nice look at that ring little brooch style ring right there looks really cool and her hands those are nice and her uh her wrist um her cuffs right there it's nice really nice really nice she does come with a blaster there it is and her hand is actually molded so her finger fits through the loop <laughs> that i i make a big deal about that but it's like I, I haven't seen that very often with these figures usually it's it's like a makeshift and the uh fingers don't fit properly you know and around her neck we got this drapery this molded drapery around her neck part of her scarf comes down in the back this is gorgeous right here all this drapery right here and then it comes down like this it's really nice um <laughs> yeah check out her boots those are all right little high heel boots come up like halfway up her her calf right there yeah all right let's let's check out her articulation she's got a ball joint i think it's just a ball joint there's yeah it's just a ball joint it's a double ball joint into the head and into the neck we've got uh, a swivel and a hinge which is really really tight yeah i do not want to break this but i, I mean i haven't really been moving these very often so yeah, that doesn't want to cooperate. I'm not going to make it do anything it doesn't want to do. Um, we got a hinge and a swivel at the elbow. <sighs> Goes that far. Let's see if we can get that elbow to move, or that shoulder to move. It should just go, right? <sighs> yeah. Oh, man, that's really tight. <laughs> it's like, oh, my gosh. <laughs> it's It's one click. And that's how far back it goes. That's one click, guys. That's that's kind of scary, actually. <laughs> Whew, man. 
So I'm not going to be doing that very often. She's just going to stand and look pretty on my shelf. And she has a, a swivel and a, um, a whip hinge in her wrist. Let's see. And this is a knock hinge in her other wrist. So uh, she has a... Yeah, she has a uh, um, a diaphragm rocker right there. She does not have a waist swivel, from what I can feel. Um, but I mean, it turns right there. That's fine. It turns at the uh, the ab, the uh, diaphragm. She does have legs. <laughs> um, the skirt lets it go that far. I mean. I don't know if it can go any further, but yeah, that's about as far as it goes. Um, okay, if you're curious, she is wearing a onesie. <laughs> yeah, so um, her legs don't have very much mobility, and I think that was kind of done on purpose because of her dress. But, I mean, you'd think that at the very least she'd be able to um, kick forward, but it's not. it's not allowing me to, see? Yeah, I, I think she's just supposed to stand and look elegant <laughs> with her dress pulled all the way up. Right? <laughs> yeah, okay, anyway, but she has a, this is solely for articulation purposes, not trying to be pervy. <laughs> so she has a waist or a, um, a thigh cut at the top, but these are painted. So they, it's kind of, it's, it's kind of grinding up the, the paint between the, the hinge right there. Then she has a double jointed knee, but it's almost unnecessary because of the articulation in the hips. There's like, n there's hardly any um, um, mobility in their hip. So I, I don't know how that plays into uh, any of the other articulation, but it just seems unnecessary. So she also has a an ankle rocker and a hinge at her other foot so there she is she stands really nice like usually when i have a figure with um with heels they don't stand very well but she just there she is i mean usually i'm just struggling but she's she's doing fine she's doing fine let's do some uh, size comparisons here she is with marvel legends mbaku and Living Laser. And here she is with Transformers Fall of Cybertron Siege Soundwave, holding Laser Beak, and McFarlane Toys Star Trek Captain Jean Luc Picard. And here she is with NECA Kenner Tribute Snake Alien and Overwatch Ultimates Tracer. Yeah, I am a very big fan of this figure. I love how it turned out. I love the likeness. It's just a beautiful and elegant pit figure. I, um, I saw Mace Windu there and uh, a couple of others that, um, that I wanted, but when I saw Vice Admiral Holdo, I had to give in because Laura Dern. Okay, guys? <laughs> she is a gorgeous actress, and I was just like... Whoa! There's there's an actual figure coming out. This was like announced like what last year, like last summer, and she's just coming out now. So I've been waiting for for a while for this one to come out, and now that I have her, I am so happy uh, with how she turned out. Um, yeah, the uh, the um, the aesthetics here, the um, the uh, paint, the wash, the digital print. Uh, the digital print could have been better. It kind of looks like it was a little too light, but it's it's all right. You know, at, at these angles, you can see her face and you know it's her, you know. Um, I would have liked more mobility in her legs, but I mean, in the movie, do you ever see her like doing the splits or kicking anybody? No. So <laughs> the... Uh, the articulation in her hips is fine. That's that's okay. She looks great. Um, I would I would like to have a different style of dress on her, or maybe like if if anyone does like custom dresses for these, that would that would be really cool because it's a nice figure, and it would be nice if like you know maybe it like kind of 
hugged her body a little bit more, give it a little more shape instead of having this like potato sack, like, you know, uh, this like, yeah, the potato sack look, it's, this looks better just pinched like that. I might put like a, a clothes pin right there just to, just to kind of keep it, you know, looking like a dress and then, and <laughs> it would look a lot nicer. Maybe I'll tie these up too, you know, just, just so it looks, um, a little more, you know, finished. So yeah, if, uh, if you're into Star Wars Black series and you liked, um, the last Jedi and Vice Admiral Holdo, or you just really like Laura Dern. Um, this is a great figure to have in your collection. All right, that's it for my review. Tell me what you think about this figure in the comments below. Um, if you like this review, give me a like. If you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you know when I put new stuff up on the channel. I'll be taking pictures of her uh, after this video, so be on the lookout for that. And uh, that'll be on my Instagram and Facebook. And thanks for watching.